Am I the asshole? For telling my sister her childhood is the reason she's not always included in things. I'm 18 F. My older sister is 26. We are our half sisters, as we share the same dad. We are the only kids to our dad. Our dad and her mom were once married I wasn't born obviously and when they divorced my sister lived with her mom 99 of the time. She grew up 4 hours away from us. I only saw her a week out of the year growing up. She would attend some holidays with our dad's side of the family. Once she graduated high school, 9 years ago she lived with our dad and I was seeing her all the time. That's when we built our relationship. My mom and dad live in the same city so I've always lived 50-50 with my parents. I so we have an aunt and uncle on our side that I basically grew up with. Ever since I was 6 I've been staying summers with them out of state up until this year. They also have a son him 2 years apart from. They tried to have my sister for summers when she was a child but because of whatever she never got to. The past 9 years my sister is finally around enough, just like I've been my whole life. I graduated this year and had a party our dad's side attended. My uncle our dad's brother booked a trip for us to go to Hawaii. His family and me. And I didn't know my sister didn't know. I didn't want to bring it up at all. When our cousin brought it up at my party my sister asked out loud you guys are going to Hawaii. And it became awkward as hell. Our uncle and aunt kinda rushed in a room and I just quickly said yay and walked away from the topic. I saw my aunt take her in a room and talk to her, I didn't know what they talked about nor did I ask until my sister reached out to me yesterday. Basically she said she's had time to think about that day and said our aunt told her that she's an afterthought because they didn't get to build a relationship with her when she was young. And because of lost time things are kinda the way they are. My sister said to our aunt that since she's been around the family more now it's ridiculous she excluded over such a thing she had no control over. She told me that she doesn't appreciate them playing favorites and excluding her and making excuses for it. Also that she didn't care about not going to Hawaii, it's the point. When they claim they wish they were closer to her. She said that they are potentially putting a wedge between us by doing things like this, and that as her sister, I should know how she feels. I told her this had nothing to do with me, and that our aunt has a point with her childhood being the biggest reason things are the way they are. I also told her she was wrong for thinking our aunt was playing favoritism. I she told me it's a shame I don't see an issue with this, and that she looks at me different for siding with my aunt, which I'm not even doing. She said she clearly can't talk to me about how she feels and it's crazy how I'm siding with someone that really hurt her. Fuck just drama. Am I the asshole? You're the asshole. In fact, the only person who isn't an R here is your sister. You're one for undermining her feelings. That's a shitty thing to do. Your aunt and uncle are one for holding her childhood against her. She had no control over where she spent her time, but she's the one getting blamed and being told she's an afterthought. What the actual fuck? Your dad is the biggest star. He failed her. He failed to be a father to her. You can't be any sort of decent parent if you only see your kid one of the time. You're the asshole for brushing it off like it's nothing. Everyone in your family other than the sister are assholes, she's equally as much family as you are. You're the asshole her childhood isn't her fault and it's cruel to blame her for her family favoring you and ignoring her. You are the golden child and you are getting things she never got, and that is objectively unfair. Why can't you at minimum acknowledge that? You're the asshole. Part of calling her sister is having her back and making sure she's included. Aunt and uncle are for living in the past. Dad wins TA of the year award for letting this happen. You're the asshole. From what you've written, your sister advocated for herself in a very clear way to your aunt impressive. Your sister then shared this with you dismissed her. I told her this had nothing to do with me, and that our aunt has a point with her childhood being the biggest reason things are the way they are. I also told her she was wrong for thinking our aunt was playing favoritism. This is such our behavior. You are taking your aunt's side. Your sister is absolutely correct. 
you're the asshole so your uncle's from your dad's side who is also her fucking dad is excluding her? And you can't see how fucking terrible that is? Horrible sister. You're the asshole. Someone told your sister to her face she's nothing but an afterthought for things that were outside her control when she was a child and you said yep, that's true. You're the asshole. Wow. Yeah, you're the asshole. Everyone except your sister is an R, actually. As soon as your sister was old enough, she made an effort to get to know your dad's side of the family. She's spent the last nine years doing that and not only is she still excluded, but you dismiss her feelings as drama. At this point, I genuinely hope she walks away from you and your dad's side of the family. You all sound like terrible people and she'd be better off without you. You're the asshole. Why are you even on here? You don't even sound like you want a relationship with your sister, so why don't you and your family tell her that, so she can get over Yarl and move on with her life? Your uncle and aunt are are and you very inconsiderate of your sister's feelings. You're the asshole. She had zero control over where she lived growing up. You said you lived four hours away from her and maybe saw her once a year because she lived with her mom which again was not her control. You and your dad's family sound bitter for whatever reason toward your sister for reasons that she couldn't control or choose. Maybe when you're older you'll see where her point is because right now you aren't putting yourself in her shoes and just labeling her as drama. You're the asshole. In so many spoiled, entitled this over and over again, princess. Your sister was left family's fault. She is still left family's fault. They make family's fault. You treat her like fault. You have the fucking nerve to call her the drama? WTF. Your aunt and uncle are horrible people and you are a horrible sister. I hope she gets therapy and writes you all off. She will be much better off with strangers who love her than with her phony ass, fake, two-faced, miserable excuse for a blood family. While I can't call you TA because you are in the middle of something that adults around you should be handling, your sister is right when she says, she's been around the family more now it's ridiculous she excluded over such a thing she had no control over. That's true. As to Hawaii, if your aunt and uncle are taking their kids and only you, that's fair for a graduation present. But otherwise, your sister is your father's daughter, as much as you are, and should be included in all of her father's family events as much as you are. Sounds to me like they booked it for her graduation. You're 18 years old, you know what you're doing. You're the asshole. She's right. She had no control over her childhood, and it's extremely unfair how she's being treated. Of course, you wouldn't see what's wrong with it because you're getting special treatment. You're the asshole, and so is your aunt and uncle. Edit your father is also an R for allowing this to happen.